Now, your news on the go. All right, we start your news on the go in Storm Team Alert as we head towards high temps. More central New York schools are heading out of the hallways early. Yeah, keep an eye on the bottom of your screen. Districts dismissing early include FM, Fulton, North Syracuse, Oneida, Rome, and Ithaca. With high schoolers already out of class, the half days only apply to middle and elementary students. But when it comes to Regents exams, all tests are still on. Yeah, take those tests. Onondaga County and the city of Syracuse offering options to cool off today. Schiller Park Pools opens this afternoon. You can dive in the deep end between 3 and 6 this afternoon. The county also just announced extended hours for both Janesville Beach and Oneida Shores. You have from noon until 8 tonight to soak in some fun uh, in the sand. For a list of all designated cooling centers across central New York, they're posted for you right now, localsyr.com. From pools to polls, after defeating spending plans last month, voters in Ithaca, Newfield, and Casanova must reconsider amended budgets for the next school year. In CAS, polls open right after the morning news at 7, but in Ithaca and Newfield, polls don't open until noon. Each district has until 9 tonight to cast their ballots. Speaking of budgets, police departments in Onondaga County have another $3 million to work with when it comes to combating crime. Governor Hochul announcing the funds as part of the state's Gun Involved Violence Elimination Initiative. This morning, we now know 30-year-old Jamar Mack, a respected youth football coach, was shot and killed Sunday morning at the Valley Plaza. Just last night, there was a large gathering in memory of the Salt City Renegades coach, friends, family, and players paying tribute by releasing balloons at Burnham Park in Mattydale. During Sunday's shooting, a 34-year-old was also hit, but is expected to survive. A plan to bring a concrete batch plant to the town of Clay has been voted down. The town board took their time reviewing findings from studies conducted by Gogan Realty, listening to the public and even looking over some studies they spent. Uh, but overwhelmingly, the information did not support the plant being built. The Boston Celtics waking up NBA champions. They took down the Dallas Mavericks four games to one. Jalen Brown wins MVP. It's the franchise's 18th championship overall. That is an NBA record. 